Hello, my name is Claude White, and um, I've got some really sad news. And I do realize that I'm a little late with it. Um, Pernell Whitaker, Sweet Pea, he was the pound-for-pound pound king in the late 80s and early 90s. He passed away at the young age of 55 due to a car accident in Virginia Beach. Um, a lot of people are going to focus. In fact, some of them will focus on his um, drug usage. He tested positive for cocaine a couple of times. I mean, he had his demons. But it's not about that today. It's about watching one of the purest boxers I've ever seen. I mean, when everybody talks about the great um, Money Mayweather, and rightfully so, Money Mayweather did retire 50-0 and 0 undefeated, and he has been the pound-for-pound pound king of his generation. Well, you know what? Sweet Pete Whitaker was the originator, was the innovator of that peekaboo style. And he did it with much more flair than Money Mayweather. And um, that's no disrespect to Floyd Mayweather. That's just how great Sweet Pea Whitaker was. And as great as he was in his wins, I remember the losses that he was given. And let's face it, he was railroaded in those fights. He was railroaded against De La Hoya. And he was definitely railroaded against um, Julio Cesar Chavez. I tell you, there hasn't been a better pound-for-pound pound fighter than Sweet P. Whitaker in the late 80s and early 90s. And I, and I tell you what, if he was to fight um, Money Mayweather in his prime, I would take Sweet P. in a heartbeat. And no disrespect to Money Mayweather. Listen, he had been the pound-for-pound pound king for 15 years. I mean, that, you can't disrespect that man. But let me tell you something. Sweet P. Whitaker was a joy to behold in the ring. And boxing is much worse without him. Rest in peace. Rest in paradise, champ. Please like, share, and subscribe, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Claude White. Please take care. And God bless.